Hi, I'm Peter Hurley. <laughs> hey guys, my name is Peter Hurley and today I am going to show you this really killer lighting setup that I designed with Westcott called the Flex Kit. You may be sitting there wondering, who is this guy? Who is this Peter Hurley character? When I started shooting, I was a natural light shooter. I used to plop myself on a windowsill, put a big window behind me, and shoot my subjects right in front, natural light, which I love, but I was shooting out of my apartment in New York. I was starting my business, it was a fledgling business, and as my business grew, it was time to get a photo studio. The first studio I got though, however, no windows absolutely no windows. I got in there and I was like, okay, now I really have to learn how to light. And I was a natural light specialist, so it was a daunting task. So I started with strobe. I didn't get what I wanted out of the strobe. I don't like all the strobe going off between me and my subject. What I really don't like, I don't like big pupils. I like to bring pupils down. And natural light always gave me really nice pupils because think about real estate in the eye. I want color. I want that pupil small. Big pupils take away the color in the eye. Who wants that? I want to show color and in my work it's really important for me. So I needed continuous light. So I went to continuous fluorescence. The problem is that over the years I couldn't dim them, I couldn't take them with me, I couldn't take them on the road. They took a lot of power, a lot of stuff that I just wanted something that was a compact source to get me the light that I needed and get me on the road. I'm mobile. More Headshots are growing more than any other genre in photography right now for shooting portraiture. Everybody needs one. And now I'm flying all over the place. I needed portability. I needed LED and I needed a compact setup that I could set up in any office anywhere in the country, in the world for that matter. I need to be simple, fast, efficient, and give me the light I want. And that's what the Flex Kit does. When you get your Flex Kit, you're gonna get two one by two. We set them up as rectangulars and I want a little smaller ones because I like to keep a tiny, I like to jam these lights together. I like to jam them right together. So I like them to be a tiny square to shoot through. I think it gives me the best light and the most control over my lights. That's why I use four lights. I use, I use the two lights, the one by twos on top and on bottom. As you can see, I'm being lit by this beautiful light right now. Are you loving this whole operation that we're seeing here? And I use the one by threes on the sides and I set them up in a, in a rectangle like this and I put the person's uh, depending on their height, the center of the light would be right around the center of their face and I get a nice fall off and then I can use fill and I can adjust and that's just for my headshot stuff. For my portrait stuff, which we're going to show you as well, we mess around with the lights too. The power coming out of them is amazing. I've got enough power to boot to go do whatever I need to do and uh, it's just been phenomenal to be able to have this kind of product. We also have got some diffusion material on the front. I like to beat up the light as it comes out of there. So I'm really into natural light, which is really soft shadows. This is the same. We got really soft shadows out of the light. Um, we've got ballasts that are adjustable. So they're on uh, digital adjustment. So you can fine tune them to the precise number that you want, which is pretty amazing. And again, they come in a nice case, full portability. You'll be on the road, ready to move taking pictures wherever you want using continuous light. The other thing that I love is that on my shoots, I always have a video guy with me. Every client asks me for a BTS video. They need content. They want content for their website. They want to make sure that they have everything covered. If they're spending money on a shoot, believe me, they're going to want video content of it covered to be able to use it for however they want for whatever purposes. So guess what I need? I need to have continuous light with me. And now I got it with the flex kit. So not only can I light my subject, I can also use it for the video, which is great. So today I'm gonna to demonstrate my flex kit setup the way that I do headshots. And I brought in a model named Chloe and she's great. So we're gonna have some fun and get some great shots of her. You know, I like to have fun with my subjects and Chloe's amazing in front of the camera so it makes it very easy, but guess why? The light on her is perfect. 
Everybody walking through that door, I know I've got the best light. They've never been shot in light like that. How much easier does that make? The technical is out of the way for me, I'm done. All I have to do is press that button in that light and I know I'm gonna get a gorgeous picture of them. Then I'm just gonna work on my rapport with them and work on expression and everything like that. Chloe's amazing. Uh, Chloe's been blessed with gorgeous looks so all I have to do is point the camera in her general direction and she looks fantastic. I like to vary my backgrounds but I'm very particular about the colors. I either go white, gray, or black. Those are the three that I usually do. If you go to my website, peterhurley.com, you can see that I have a portfolio that's called Back in Black. So before we were shooting Chloe, we were shooting strobes onto the background and make it go white. If I wanted to go gray, I just turn the strobes down and I'll get the nice fall off from the, from the flex kit onto the, gray, onto the white, which will create a gray background for me. But if I want black, I don't like, I don't like my subjects to fall into the black, like a really deep, deep black. So I designed a board that I sell through my Hurley Pro website. It's hurleyprogear.com. It's called Black Matte Pro Board. And I like shooting people wearing black on black, but I like separation. So it's got a chalky surface to it. So I'm not even, I'm just lighting it with the lights in front and it's not, I'm letting the fall off light the black pro board just to bring the black from a really deep black to a very, very subtle smoky kind of black. It gives it this chalky surface, almost a deep, deep thunder gray. And Chloe has on a black leather jacket. You can see from the images how the black, the jacket really pops off that black background. Really nice. Instead of just getting sucked into it, you get really good separation over the shoulder. Great stuff. All right, so this was amazing. Chloe's amazing. I just wanted to show you a little bit. If you shoot two people in front of these lights, this setup, this is the light I use for shooting multiple people. If I shoot a family, I'll throw up the square and the four lights. You see how even it is across of, uh, both our faces? It's huge to have the, the even lighting. So uh, I'd like to thank Chloe for coming and doing some amazing pictures. Thank you. If you want to find out more about this fabulous system that we've designed here, go to fjwestcott.com.